After 1961, Little was heard from Katsura for many years after the 1961 World Championship. McGordy lamented her retirement, stating various theories that he had heard bandied about in billiard circles, such as that her husband, 18, who died in June 1967, 105, kept her from playing for various reasons. In 1976, Katsura made an impromptu appearance at Palace Billiards in San Francisco. She borrowed a cue from someone present and proceeded to run 100 points at straight rail without problem. Prolific pool and billiard author Robert Byrne wrote that after Katsura finished that 100-point run, without a miss she smiled and bowed to the applauding crowd, stepping away from the spotlight, and disappeared forever from the American billiard stage. 5. Katsura returned to Japan in or about 1990 to live with her sister, Noriko, where she said she planned to live out her days. Katsura died in 1995, too. In September 2002, a memorial tournament for Katsura, billed as Katsura Memorial, the first lady's three cushion Grand Prix, was held in Japan and aired on Sky Perfect TV 107. Legacy On March 7, 2021, Katsura was featured in a Google Doodle on the search engine's homepage as part of its celebration of International Women's Day 108. Footnotes as opposed to pocket billiards, commonly called pool, 109, carom billiards games are typically played on cloth-covered, 5 by 10 foot, approximately 1.5 by 3 m, pocketless tables with three balls used in the play of most games, two cue balls, one for each player, and a third ball. At their simplest, the object of carom games is to score points or counts by caroming one's own cue ball off both the opponent's cue ball and the third object ball on a single shot.